Life is certainly never dull in New York City. The Upper West Side of Manhattan, members of the public having to direct cars because the traffic lights weren't working. And this was the New York subway, much of it cast into darkness, the trains providing the only illumination. These photographs were taken by one Manhattan resident who told the BBC what it was like when the lights went out. It's very eerie because half of the city is essentially black and the other half that I can see south is just fine. So um, it's, it's a strange place to be from my vantage point. One part of town affected was Broadway, with many shows having to be cancelled. Jennifer Lopez tweeting, Devastated and heartbroken that I can't perform for all of you tonight. We will make this up to you, I promise. Irony of ironies, all this happened 42 years to the day after the famous New York blackout of 1977. That was on a much larger scale and lasted nearly two days. But a reminder of how things can go very wrong indeed. This could have been much worse. When you're talking about a city like New York with a significant piece of the city basically suffering a blackout, uh, that could be a very chaotic situation. Uh, we saw the exact opposite. Some traffic problems continued into the night, even after power was restored to all of Manhattan. Times Square was unaffected, still lit up like a Christmas tree. New York is always defiant. Tim Allman, BBC News.